Hey, what is up guys? Guitar Rock here. Welcome back to another FWTR video. We'll be doing some BOH for now. And damn man, it's tough. It's tougher than you think. So I'm just contemplating and choosing my opponents right now. Let's see. I'm gonna fight this guy. You're gonna give it a shot. Alright, I'm gonna attempt to fight Mimi Neko. Let's see if I can fight this person. Let's see if I can win. Alright, we want to win, obviously. Carrot. Uh, high Human Guardian or just the Soul Gear? It's quite hard to tell. Let's see if we can kill Thanatos first. Alright, looks like it's a. Uh, Oh, that's pretty strong to be honest. Is she still alive? Barely. Extremely, extremely barely. Alright, no revive. That's, that's interesting. Machine gun carrot. Dirt, 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 dirt. Let's try to heal ourselves. I'm gonna get stunned. I don't have stun immunity on my carrot, but that's fine. Uh, oh, oh, my carrot's dead. Double attack. We can do this, man. We can do this. Uh, send her here. Man, this Soul Gear is so good. In case you guys are wondering, I have the... Not Soul Gear, sorry. I meant the... The Hero's Mark. So my... Chris is protecting everyone with her passive Hero Mark. It helps. It helps out a lot, man. Like, if you want to have a proper tank for your team, get that Hero Mark and use Chris in BOH. Look at that. 10 spots. We are up 10 spots. Alright, so we have a couple of guys here. Hmm. Interesting. I'm gonna change up Carrot and Sarah. Put Sarah second so she can have much more, a uh, higher chance to brand more uh, opponents. If I beat all three of them, I get additional swords. But I've tried fighting this guy and he's quite tough. You know what, I'll give him a shot again. Hero guy. Alright, last time I checked this guy had like at least three unprecedented sets. So, we'll see, we'll see. Ah. That's tough, but I think we can do this. Oh, no ice tall for me. Interesting. Oh man, I'm immobilized. I should have give her an Omni. Oh, we actually did it this time. And I think it's because I moved first. Oh, I didn't move first. He's so good, definitely move first. Alright, place Sarah right here. Nah, don't be a coward. Let's place Sarah right here. Third skill, Thanatos, breathe your fire. Double attack. 6280. Man, he's so, she's so far away. Carrot's dead, I think. And revive. Right, let's move as further away as I can. Phew! Alright, we got it. And I'm not sure what 
happened previously that I lost but yeah finally I did it alright I'm not too comfortable fighting this guy he has two scissors uh, Tai Hua uh, yeah maybe I should give it a shot let's go Pietar and he gets to move first as usual I don't know why I always move last but I'm not complaining Ildo gets to move first alright Bell Taihua hmm this is tough oh my god dodge go step Taihua it's gotta be a go step one right let's see if he has that high dodge movement 9 dodge 63% Makes sense, man. Makes freaking sense. It's gotta be a go step, Taihua. Can I do it? Yeah! Yeah! Dead Bell. Oh my god, that damage. Alright, I'm gonna risk it here. Ah, oh, that dodge, man. Come on. Come on. Alright, can, can I at least... It's going to be annoying because I need to kill him twice. Oh man, I'm so glad he went for my Chris right there. The aggro sets actually paid off. Alright, this should be perfect. Ghost that wears out already. Decrease defense. Alright, that's... Uh, that's a gold tiger yield though. For sure. Look at that. 250,000 HP. Is it a gold tiger yield though? I'm not sure. Let's see. Hmm. Maybe not. Or maybe yes. I'm not sure. But he has Lime King, I think. It's quite tanky. Alright. It's not that tanky anymore. He didn't receive much damage from my... Carrot, so I, I assume he has Slime King on him. Uh, yeah, let's check it out just for fun. Slime King Ildo, yes, I was right. Alright, makes sense. It's kind of a waste, man. If only this guy actually used uh, Awaken Hero. Awaken Heroes instead of Celestial and Bell. Come on. If you guys did not check out my video, I did uh, a video explaining the differences and I showed like, like what are the benefits you can get. The stats boost is just so real. Just a lot of stats boost. Go Han, let's go. Two thousand eight hundred points. A Nox as usual. And luckily, I have confusion immunity on my Chris. I have all the immunities on her. Thirty-seven percent dodge. Can I? Boom. Revive, of course, makes sense. Hmm, I think I can kill this guy. Let's give it a shot. So, show Sarah's true strength. Boom, boom. Sarah is very strong. Uh, I'll try to make a review of, about her soon enough, but. And most people complain about her passive not working correctly like I mean not to say not working correctly but it can be resisted like if you have high resistance you might not actually get it off like it's something that can be removed easily as well if you have Omni and things like that the brand brand is real All right how do I do this um, wait, does this skill recover Restores twenty percent. I've no idea what am I doing. Hopefully, oh man. All right, that's bad. Gold Tiger Nox activated. What do I do? And. 
Gold Tiger Nox, man. Gold Tiger Nox. Let's distract this Nox. Alright, remember Awakening Skill is the key to kill a Gold Tiger Nox, so you want to save everyone's Awakened Skill. Sierra. Move her here. Move him here. Alright, so I have Car Carrot's Awakened Skill, I have Sierra's Awakened Skill, so I'm not, not too afraid of any counter. Besides, my carrot has two lives. Alright, we did it. Finally. Uh, 22 points, not bad. Let's have a look at this guy's Nox. So, pretty standard Nox build would be... What do you call it? Iron Fist of the East for slot. Man, I have low battery. Low battery. Alright, so standard Nox build usually consists of Iron Fist, Green Ranger and Outer Space, Defender of the Earth and Gold Tiger. That's the pretty much standard. And yes, just as I mentioned it, this guy has the standard build, but it's not a full Defender of the Earth. Well, you do get that bonus HP, which is cool, but yeah. I guess that bow is for crit rate. Let's have a look. 46% crit rate. Alright, pretty decent. Pretty good knocks. Alright, let's use the bonus that we get to actually do something good. Lazy Cat, Chant, Turbo Cache, uh, Camphor, Duke Venture. I actually feel like fighting this guy since he has 3 rock heroes. I have 3 paper on my side. Should I? His total CP. Uh, BP CP sort of scares me though. That's like 20, 30,000 higher than mine. I don't know. But let's go. I'm gonna give it a shot. Cool haze. So yeah, let me know what you guys think of my Sarah. Uh, pay attention to her, and I'll show you something at the un end of this video. All right, you guys will be surprised. Boom. Dead. Maybe this is the gold tiger crease or something. I don't see. Uh, it's not a high human guardian crease. And these guys' crease don't have any. What do you call it? The hero, hero mark yet. I don't see any protect effect going on right there. Is crease dead? No. This crease move again. Got stunned. Alright, this is bad, my... Ah, oh, my Chris and Sierra died just like that. Alright, I got it. Why is she so far away? Come on. Come on. Second skill to get the overload effect. Second skill again to get more overload. Oh my god. Alright, awaken skill time. Unless this Chris have some sort of revive. Which she doesn't. Alright. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Alright, so my Sarah is doing good so far. Not great, but good. I want to have a look at this guy's uh, team for a short while. What does he have on Chris? 62,000 CP. That's pretty high. Pretty cool looking rune. Alright, uh, Slime King. Oh, the Chris has Slime King? I actually don't really feel that. But yeah, it is a Gold Tiger Outer Space Chris, so... Makes sense. Alright, I have one more. One more. Who should I choose? 
Duke Ventior, Camphor. Maybe I should fight Camphor. I feel more confident when I have a look at this guy and like he has two rock heroes because my, my team essentially consists of three paper. Uh, yeah, let's give it a shot. This is the last sort. I'll try to make a second wave later on. A second recording. Alright, let's have a look at the team. How should I do this? Uh, ignore the Chris. Carrot attack Thanatos. Boom! Dead! Easy. And then... Sarah attacks Hong Yong. If she does, if she don't die right here, uh, I'm gonna be so pissed. All right, never mind. Never mind, she did die. All right, this Chris is protecting them. Maybe it's a high human guardian build or some sort of hero mark already obtained. Revive carrot, you can do it. Boom. 78,000 Alright, alright, alright Man, I can't Oh, I can Oh, I can Whoa Alright, I thought I saw some, some uh, Oh, my carrot's still alive, I forgot. <laughs> I totally forgot about her, like she's right there hiding in the corner. Alright. Can Sarah kill Chris right here? Cool, cool. Pretty cool. Sarah is a beast, man. Like, she's literally a beast. Like, not even joking. Definitely one of the best uh, paper attack type heroes right now. Besides Carrot, of course, and I'll get to that in the much more detailed review, but definitely Carrot is much more... Uh, she is useful, definitely, in offense, but if you set her up in Garrison, she won't work properly, because the AI, you know, it's quite dumb. Let me scroll to Chris. Slime King? Oh my god, Masera actually killed that Chris with Slime King. And Sarah is an attack type, and I have no difficulty killing a Chris with Slime King. What? I was expecting her to have um uh, to have a lot more difficult time in killing Chris. But yeah, she definitely surprises me. All right, so I have one more sword. Uh, one more sword. Let's see who should I use it on. Most likely this guy, Duke Ventior. One, two. Left. Alright. Alright, let's give it a shot. Duke Ventur. Let's see, what do this guy have? Uh Thanatos, Nox, Nox. Hundred and fifty-four thousand. Hmm. Definitely another hero. Hero Mark shit going on, or High Human Guardian, I can't tell. Most likely Hero Mark. Did I kill Thanatos? I think he is dead, right? Alright. Dead. Should I... Yeah, we should. Boom! Boom! Awesome. Yeah, yeah, I'm confused. I'm not confused. I'm stun immune, man. Wow, this Chris is tanky. For sure. I've seen. If I shoot this guy, I'll get countered for sure. Oop, 
What? Did the Nox just die? What? Like I can't. I feel like they should have made the made the animation much more prominent. I can't even tell like whether the opponent is still alive or dead. But wow, my carrot actually, she's doing her job. That's awesome. Let's see. Don't think we are getting anything out of that. Third skill again. Is this a gold tiger, Chris, or no? can see a pretty high regen on her. 231,000. Not bad, not bad. Look at this. Boop! Dead. Dead, Chris. Alright, so, so far so good. Mm, really liking my team, but uh, if I wasn't using Sarah, I would be using Mei and I think Mei is awesome and one of the best attack type uh, Caesar attack type right now that you can obtain well if you if you don't obtain her then it's too bad but at least she's purchase purchasable via crystals that's kind of cool alright you ready for the moment of truth let me show you guys something look at this this is my carrot's equipment, alright? Look at my Sarah's equipment. Bam! Total crap. Total crap. Like this is the crappiest equipment you could have on a hero. And she's doing great. Like she's doing great. Like really. My equipment uh, is nothing to write home about. Uh, I'm yet to plus 15 everything and the slot 5 like I could I could easily replace that with something better and this slot 3 as well if I've beast rain on her she would definitely be way 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 stronger but look at this these are the items and equipments I have on her and yet she's doing good imagine I have Dasso and beast rain oh yeah one more thing I don't have any of her costume and I don't have any of her soul gear. So yes, Sarah is good. She's better than you think. Even without soul gear. Right now, I don't have any soul gear. Not, let's not talk about bloody soul gear, but I don't have any soul gear at all. And she's doing great in BOH. She's carrying me this far. So if you guys are still doubt, having doubts about her, uh, do not worry about it. Clear your doubts. I hope this can clear all your doubts. And yes, she's, she's actually strong, you know? She's strong man, she's cool! And imagine if I have this soul gear right now. She'll be a beast man, she'll be a beast. No one can survive her attacks, definitely. Uh, definitely if you think of purchasing her, go ahead. I know there are some people who are struggling to think about, oh, uh, should I get Sarah if I cannot afford to purchase her bloody soul gear because it's using cash? My answer is yes. Still get her, she's good. Uh, you won't need her soul gear anytime soon. I mean, at least get the free one, uh, the free soul gear. If you can't afford the bloody soul gear, that's fine, you don't really need it. She's strong enough without those bloody soul gear. Just get the free soul gear. Alright, so I uh, hope you enjoyed the video, guys. Uh, I'll end the video right now, right here, because I don't have any more swords I'm running out of them. And I don't think I'll reset. 30. Should I? Nah, maybe not. Alright guys, uh, hope you like the video. If you do, please give it a like. And if you're new to the channel, please subscribe to the channel. So you won't miss out anything awesome. Any other FWTR video that I'll be making. And I'm working on the Bloody Soul Gear review. A more detailed and in-depth kind of perspective. Uh, hope you guys stay tuned for that. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Have a nice day. Goodbye.